Well, hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel, O Patreon, depending on which platform you're watching this video. We are quite far ahead with the Patreon reactions, which can find an uncut and full opacity, and the link is in the description below. Today we are watching episode 11 of the magnificent Free Ren. In the previous episode, Free Ren not only defeated Aura, but he used a deceitful technique by concealing the amount of mana and taking control of Aura's body thanks to the magical scales. If this is not a masterpiece, I don't know what is. Fern and Stag also stood their ground, and I'm really curious to see what is going to happen in the future adventures. So let's tune in. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to help this channel grow. Thanks. And the scales have turned into a dust. Barrier is still standing and the biggest enemy is gone. It's very noble of her to pray towards the souls who are trapped and manipulated by the demon for so long. Now these souls can finally rest in heaven. I got to say, Aura's power was a really nasty one. <sighs> so many fallen. All the soldiers that have died 80 years ago until now. Such a big army, it's all of his ancestors. She really did, because she properly def re she refused to fight them, she just kept releasing them. <laughs> you get to respect her dad. Oh, trained. <laughs> he definitely taught her about the ways of the world. Some morals. How to be humane. Yay! Oh, but they are so happy now. <laughs> oh, next time. <laughs> beautiful music in the background. It really reminds me of Lord of the Rings and their beautiful songs. That's his son, right? So many lost souls. And treated in a crow way and free run have released all of them. She's a real elven angel. <laughs> well, technically the threat is gone. Oral tradition. <laughs> this is a little bit, little bit weird. <laughs> Why do you have a smile on your face? あ、<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> He tricked him, he tricked him big time. <laughs> he totally froze. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if this is what I actually want. <laughs> well, that sure as hell looks weird. 
Look at that, it's like a big burger, it's amazing. Oh, well, that's interesting. Wait, no problem then. <laughs> Surely Freelan is an S-class mage. No way, don't tell me she has to get certified. Okay. She's a fair class mage. Just how powerful do you have to be to be a uh, A class? <laughs> Good point. <laughs> hmm. I know, right? So frequently. <laughs> Else first world problems. <laughs> Oh, wow, so I'm guessing that's where she's headed now. Yeah, if she must do it, then she must, you know, what can you do? Otherwise, they won't be able to cross. He's a nice lord. I liked him. Yeah. Worse are seasonal, aren't they? Surely they have some sort of warming magic, right? You would think they do have that. <laughs> oh dear. This is more serious than I thought. But can they not cast some sort of protective spell that also warms you up? I bet he is. I mean, he's all, his, his axe itself is really heavy. Oh, I think he is there. Been hell of for 80 years. That's amazing. Wow. Uh, hello? <laughs> <laughs> it is them who barged in and he's an elf wow well, that's rare wow <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> the warrior. <laughs> As if it was that simple. Oh. I think she'll have to get naked and warm him up <laughs> with her body. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can only imagine how cold it is there. What is he doing there? <laughs> that was so weird. <laughs> oh, that would totally have this dessert now. That's not what I thought would happen, but okay. It's interesting that Elf is letting him touch him. <laughs> Wake up, man, there's something strange happening. <laughs> 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 
Where are these guys' clubs, by the way? Monk. Interesting. <laughs> Magic would come handy. That's nice. That's a shame. <laughs> <laughs> Which village they're from? Hmm. <laughs> I like the training. It reminds me of different anime I watched. Nice scavenging skills. Amazing. I wonder how long do we have to stay there? Six months? Wow. Yeah, it's interesting. Must be an elven belief. Then just... Just how old is he? <laughs> Mm. I see. Gosh, it must be really hard to be elves. Silly fox. Or is it a wolf? Must be a wolf. Interesting. <laughs> 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 he does have a good say to him though. <laughs> Pure. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> Isn't that a sin to be drinking? <laughs> I do like that they have a female god. A god of creation. Should be female, right? That kind of makes sense. Hmm. Well said. Indeed. Almost a child. Almost his child. <laughs> but they can adopt. <laughs> I feel like Fern and Star are getting a little bit closer, you know? Every time, it just melts my heart. <sighs> Few centuries. Wow. It amazes me every time. It's the first anime that takes such an approach in life. First anime I've watched of that kind. First anime that awakens so many emotions within me and really makes me think about the value of life and its length. And we should cherish the moments, especially Freerun, she's lived for so long. It is an interesting episode that we have met a monk elf who's been walking on the air on that particular land for possibly thousands of years if he's calling her young. <laughs> and he obviously looked older than her. In the background, you can kind of get the feeling that Fern and Stag are getting slightly more closer with each other. 
I have a warm feeling in my heart about it. Episode 12, a real hero. Wow. Oh, she must be really tired. <gasps> oh, oh dear. <laughs> He's really strong, isn't he? I'm sure Farron is impressed by that. <laughs> but she could have just flowed her with her magic. I don't understand why why won't they do it. Although it could be a little bit disrespectful, but perhaps there is a way. Ten copper coins. Hmm. Kinda makes sense. レプリカですよ。<笑><笑> <laughs> I'm sure there were more reasons to that. Oh, <laughs> I have a license to be a priest. <laughs> a beautiful and warm dream. I'm glad there is a village in a place like this, you know? Oh. Bless her. <laughs> don't think she will give... <laughs> don't think she will give her master. Oh. No, she won't. I love how she's protecting her master from indecency. <laughs> hmm, that's not good. Oh. oh, thank god, I was worried that the village is just like wiped out by a blizzard. I am a little bit confused. Wow, a child in charge. Interesting. But for the village, they are nicely sturdy and stone built. Oh. Interesting. Wow, that's amazing. So Himal is like a, a, a King Arthur from the legend. Wow. <laughs> のおばあさまの遺言。私は80年後でも大丈夫だと言ったんだけど。確かにそうですけれども、ちゃんとお役目を果たしてもらわないと。わあ。役目って何ですか?魔物大地だよ。おお。ノアノプスタクルフォー。
proper ones to um, train Stark in that way. That's really good. It's really good training for him. Good job, Baron. But what's in the cave? Oh. Why is the sword still there? Oh. Exactly. But that's a very interesting turn of events, you see. He totally did. And that the Kengan Legends are so strange. But they were just normal people. So just who will be the person that will pull that sword from the stone? And when? <laughs> that was cute. Beautiful region. Mm, I miss that look of mountains covered in snow. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> He's only 18! <laughs> <gasps> oh, no, Rira, no! <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so ruthless! <laughs> <laughs> Something better, I hope. Oh, a ring. What's the story behind it? I think this is going to be funny. Them trying to figure out just what would Stark want. Is he training? Aww. He's a good lad, isn't he? Very helpful. Perhaps if he used it on Fern. <laughs> you would totally enjoy that potion, you see. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> あ、なんかくれんの。いや、ふざけていたわけじゃなくて。I don't think he's used to getting 
I see, so this is the kind of environment he grew in. No wonder he doesn't believe in himself. <gasps> Oops. Oh, so he's a good brother. He didn't mind getting his rope dirty. The demon army. Oh, God. oh no. Oh, no. の、<笑><笑><笑><笑> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I wish you could him like a hearty go or something like this. Oh, somebody was cooking well done. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> <笑>戦士ってのは武器用だね。フィリピン様がそれを言うんですか。これはね。そういう風だ。誰かの誕生日に旅に行ったかみたいなでかいハンバーガーを作ってやる。これは俺の地方の風習でな。そう、I'm did that for Stark as well. Because you recognize him. And his brother as well. Wow. Oh my god. Now that's truly precious. He saved him in that way. Oh gosh. Many things that my family have done for me and I just haven't appreciated because I didn't understood. There's many things that I have remembered that my family have done for me long time ago. Many things that still possibly remain a mystery. Possibly things I've done for some people they haven't realized how much it meant. That's just how it is. But it might make someone smile one day.
A beautiful episode. Truly hope that Freeran will reach Aureola and get to speak to him now. So thank you for watching with me and see you in the next episode.